Hey guys, how's it going? Ashfury here and today I want to show you a little experiment I did with a new awakened item that was just introduced in the game. Because it's an item designed for Super Saiyan 2 Gohan, one of my favorite characters in the game, I really wanted to make this item for him. So I jumped directly into the new Rising Rush in order to gather all the necessary mats for it. Now, after the last update, the Rising Rush missions were nerfed. Before the update, for each step there were a lot of battles, like 20 or 30 for each rush, but now, after the update, there were only 10 battles for each step, which is a lot better. It took me about 30 minutes to finish all 3, since uh, these are not very hard, maybe the last one a bit harder because all the fighters are level 3000, but there was no problem since I have a lot of upgraded fighters to level 3000. After finishing all the missions, I've gathered some of the necessary mats and immediately jumped to the Equipment Awakening section to upgrade my item. Of course, it's not that easy, because to upgrade it you need more than just the mats uh, I got from the Rising Rush missions. So, in order to upgrade one item, it's required to have 50 Red Fragments 1, 8 Rare Fragments 1, uh, these are collected all from Rising Rush missions. Besides that, it's also required to add 3 Believe in Yourself Gohan equipment upgraded to A level and 5 random A gold type equipment. This is a considerable amount of mats, but hey, it's for Gohan, so I will not complain about it. I want to mention that to upgrade a Believe in Yourself Gohan item to A level, it's required 300 Red Rising Souls 1. 100 Red Rising Souls 2, this is for the first upgrade, and for the second upgrade, 10 Super uh, Souls Red 1 and 5 Super Souls Red 2. In this video, I will make 3 Awakened items, so that's a lot of resources, but like I said, it's for Gohan and he deserves it. Before we start, let's see the differences between the normal item and the Awakened item. Now, of course, the Awakened item is better, especially for slot 3 where Blast attack bonus is added, which is really awesome for Goham. But, in this case, the real question is if I get lucky to make a really good item from these 3 items that I'm about to make. With that being said, let's upgrade the items. On the left hand side, you can see that the first bonus that we get on slot 1 is health restoration. And this is between 10 and 15%, where 15% is the maximum value that we can get for this. I don't think we'll get the maximum value, but I'm hoping to get a value that is really close to 15%. This is the first item that is about to be upgraded. Let's see what we have. I'm super excited. I hope to get a good one. And the first item is D type equipment. Uh, plus 12.65% bonus. It's not bad. I'm pretty happy with that. I mean, it can get better. It can get like a C value, but uh, for the first try, it's good. We still have two more. Now let's select again three normal believe in yourself Gohan items, five eat gold type equipment. I have plenty of those for the from the star event that it's ongoing now, and. We are about to start the second item, and for the second item we have uh, the same value like the first one, plus 12.65%. I really hope that this is not something standard, but I don't think so, maybe I'm. this is just my luck. And let's see, the third item, selecting all the mats that are required for this, again 5 uh, gold type equipments. I have plenty of those, like I said, and for the third one, let's see what we get. And we get we get a C type equipment plus 13 plus 55 percent. Now this is real good. I have really high hopes for this item. Let's upgrade now also slot two and slot three. As you can see on slot two we have strike and blast defense and the range is between 8 and 12 percent. And on slot three we have strike and blast attack. Strike it's 15 up to 25 and blast it's 8 up to 12 percent. Let's see the first item and the first upgrade it's. 10.20 it's again exactly in the middle and now the item is B and let's see for the next upgrade for slot 3 and we get we get an A type equipment we see there that the blast it's 8.85% which is really low it's at the low end of the range doesn't matter we still have two more let's see the second one first upgrade it's 9.85 
it's again at the middle and now it's B type equipment and for the third one now this is an S equipment and we have very good values 20.80 and 10.40 really good let's see the third one but I'm super excited about the second one third one it's again at the middle for for strike and defense 9.85 and for last upgrade it's 18.70 and 9.40 it's a little worse but still an S equipment and I think the second one is the best one and I got all of these three. This concludes this small experiment. I hope you guys like it and enjoy it. Uh, from the three items that I got I will use item number two and if I compare this item with the original item that is equipped on Gohan all the stats were upgraded. Hell restoration is better, strike and blast defense is better, strike attack is better and even blast attack bonus was added which is really good for Gohan. Okay, this concludes this small video. I hope you guys like it. Until next time, this is Arch Fury. Bye!